Do you want to pull up um, Dear Jonah really quickly? <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, let's pull it up. And let me tell you, so this is amazing, and you'll love this. So I set out to do a... Um, is my fucking phone talking? Um, so I set out to do a special called The Pandemic Special. And... Do that again. So I set out to do something called um, The Pandemic Special. And this stuff, I love this. So this... Uh, uh, pause right here. Pause right here. Okay, so I set out to do the pandemic special, which is all my pandemic material, because I was like, I can't use it anymore. I want to get it almost as a time capsule. Mm. And <clears throat> you, you know, as you guys know, I'm I'm really an improviser. It's like my strength. And so I did, I did. So I just, but I was like, I need stand up to show people that I'm a stand up comic. You know, that's just really, really important. And so what I, um, what ended up happening is I started to do this show, and the first show was awful. I did I did this at Zany's in Nashville, and mm. I, mostly because I came up with this great idea for a backdrop, but also because those were the places I was playing during the pandemic. That was the whole idea, was these kind of clubs in, like, Tennessee. And so I, <clears throat> I went into the second show on Friday, which is always really difficult for the most always part. Always the notorious the worst show. Notoriously the worst show. And the audience was amazing. And I was like, oh, my God, this is so incredible. This is going to be the special audience. And this guy started heckling me in the front row. Mm. And I was like, TJ, don't pay attention to him. Just stay the course. He's probably going to be quiet. And he wouldn't stop heckling me. And one of the, he was doing weird heckles, like not mean, but just like, that's good. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, I agree with that. Or like, yeah, that's true. That's funny because it's true. So then finally I'm like, oh, this mm. fucking drunk is going to ruin my goddamn. So then I go and I say something to him about his cargo pants. Okay. <laughs> okay. And he is not drunk and uh, he is not a heckler mm -hmm. he's this guy jonah ah like all the time so, so he's talking about why he I, likes even though I, even though I do not why he likes cargo bags here, here in the okay i got you i want you guys to know that i am not going to make fun of him at all <laughs> pause pause isn't that a great backdrop? Right. It's all different fake in the Zanies comedy club because the top one Zanies mm -hmm. is the real thing. Yeah. So those are all fake comedy clubs. <laughs> funny, funny. Sp Crickets fakes, is a great yeah. fucking, yeah. Tummy tickler. I like my buddies Nick Vatterot is hilarious. Like, oh, pun yeah. comfortable silences. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so yeah, so that's that was Jonah, and so then I kind of said, "Look, I'm not going to make fun of this guy. Yeah. It's great." And then throughout the show, he like interrupted me again, so I incorporated him. And then eventually, the show was kind of about him. People wanted to hear what he had to say. I was sort of involving. He has the funniest line in the entire special. The closer <laughs> right, right. is something with him that we do together. Yeah, and it was it's like perfect. Because that's exactly it did everything that I needed to do. Wow! It's it shows people how how good I am as an improviser, and then if you come see a show, you have no idea where it's going to go. It shows that I am a comic and I have strong material, and also shows that I'm like a good guy. Yeah. Because I never made fun of this guy, and there's never a moment where it seems like I'm going to. And I kind of the whole show spent it slowly kind of lifting him up. And making him the star of the show. Oh. Yeah, and it's really sweet. I mean, honestly, people tell me that at the end of the special, they're, like, crying. Because oh. they're like, how is this guy? And you can tell, because he's a huge fan of Deadpool and a huge fan of me. And I said, oh, did you know that I had Sam? He goes, oh, yeah. He said, I, I saw you before, and I was in the back. And he's like, so I said, I got to go and see you again and be in the front. And that's why he sat so He was in front. He was touching the stage. His table was wow. touching the stage because he figured if it was good in the back, it was going to be so much better in the front, right? Because that's it gets better as you get closer to the performer, which is kind of fucking true. It is true, yeah. And so is it's he, just, it's like the best. Is he it's normal? Is there something going on with him? Or of course, yeah. Okay, I don't want to know. I don't want to say the word, but well, what, <laughs> you know what I mean? what's funny is, is he that he's he's developmentally retarded. <laughs> and I that's, told you, know, it's hilarious. you, double, I told, you doubled down on what no, no, no. I was gonna say. I couldn't even say. No, so I said. So I said that's that. That's next level. Because it's no, it's me <laughs> it's medical. It's medical <laughs> that thing. And I said that, and this, there was like this. What would you call diabolical retarded? Kind of, what is it? No, no diabolical. Diabol <laughs> Jesus, Bobby. Gosh. What did he no, say? You know what? What'd you say? So listen, so he's, so, so, so I was talking about this with my, because this woke girl, this comic, cause she's really funny, but she was like, she kept being like, special needs. And oh, I was like, I okay, see. yes, absolutely. It's, I, oh, yeah. But, yeah. Uh, but then, then I was talking to my neuropsychologist <laughs> about it, and I said, he, he is, he's del developmentally retarded. That is the name for it, right? Oh, del she del goes, I said diabolic. She goes, head. yeah, that would have been insane. <laughs> 
<laughs> that would be so insane. He was. Crazy. Um, and he's just <laughs> diabolical. <laughs> uh, <laughs> he's diabolically. So I, I said that in uh, to my neuropsychologist, and she goes, it is still, it's a medical term, but we prefer to say intellectually deficient. Okay. And I was like, What? That's even worse. That's worse. That's worse. Yeah. It's painful. It's, it's kind of like, no, yeah. you don't have it. It's never going to happen. Instead of calling someone slow, you're like, no, he stopped. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's He's worse. not slow. He He's, stopped. He stopped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it is worse, but it there's worse. no way. So whatever it is, <laughs> special needs is kind of Wait, strange. What's the term and she now you're going to say um, intellectually don't say it. Don't deficient. Say it again. Intellectually deficient. Isn't that weird? That's crazy. Yeah. It's pretty harsh. It's harsh. That's what I'm saying. That's why I was like, retardation is just okay. the, like. I mean, I okay. I love it. I don't know if I'm gonna get in trouble for this. It's Probably. Fine. No, you're not. Um, because you, you were so nice to him. Well, and, and you, you named a special after the guy. Yeah, and it's it's sort of a love letter to him. Oh, you know? you're a good guy. Is man. what it ended up being. And so he's and his um, his high school teacher reached out to me. Wow. And because she was like the counselor for the special needs kids, mm -hmm. and she said, "I watched that, and it was so amazing, and it just made my heart soar, and it brought a tear to my eye." And she said, "It just, I, I know that it means the world to him." And so that was was really really cool. And I can't wait to go back to Tennessee. I'm hoping that he comes to see a show. No, you should I'll go have lunch hear... with him or something. Yeah, because I want to I'd want to yeah. hear what he thinks of the special because I'm sure he loved it. But at the time, you can see he's like mm -hmm. he can feel. Everybody in this room is sold out. It's two or three hundred, whatever it is. It's hundreds and hundreds of people that are like loving him, like just being like, we love this guy. You're great. You're hilarious. You're doing it. And you can just feel him taking that in because that doesn't happen to him a lot. A lot of the time people are making fun of him or they want him to get out of the way in the grocery store or they think that what? he's parking incorrectly or whatever it is. Nobody's patient with him. Get out of the way! I, 